my pills too. Looking for the recipe, hoping for the better me. Should I listen to my ex girl every time she said to me that life right. is just more than just chasing the bread? Embrace me the secret, then give me some head. Lost that shit over the stupidest things like the smallest of proms and thinking it brings. I'm laughing a lot, but ain't what it seems. Maybe it's just cause of all of the weed. Maybe cause people be playing too much. So honestly, they are just jokes to me. Look at me now, in need of a break. I'm trying to feel good. What does it take? No more for the pick of the fuck out my face. I be all alone, man. I be all alone, man. I've been feeling low, man. So I'm a smoke of bone, man. I be all the road, man. I be all alone, man. I've been feeling low, man. So I'm a smoke of bone, man. I be on the road, man. I be all alone, man. You know, sometimes, you know, we just. Just feel right. lost and confused. You just feel like we don't belong anywhere. And that shit can feel like Yo, a What up, Fernando? What's up, Dawson? What up, Marshall? EJ? Corey Wilson? Jersh? Nate? How's everybody doing today? How's everybody going? Y'all having a good night? Gonna, I, I, I got all of my all of my negative shit out in the video, so so none of that shit today. In the stream. How's everybody doing? Alejandro, what's going on, man? But yeah, I'm going to be debuting two brand new immortals today uh, during the hiatus. Um, I, I did a little bit of grinding, not a ton, but I did get the new Jackie Robinson card, which I'm pretty pumped about, and the stand usual. After the, uh, after the ranked season ended, I was finally, I had enough available to, uh, to get that done. So... Yeah, we've got that. Also, if you guys want to, a little bit later, I do want to play like one rank season game just to, just to, you know, play with these guys and see how they are and everything. But I do have a little bit of a battle royale re uh, run going right now. We've, uh, damn, Greg Garcia is playing up. Uh, might use him a little bit. But uh, we have a little bit of a battle royale run going right now. Nothing crazy, just six wins. But uh, we might try to get. I don't know. We might try to get that Carter Caps or something later on tonight. I appreciate that, Nate. Appreciate that, man. You got Ruth? Yeah, Ruth is my next target. No doubt about it. Um, it, it well, him, I'm going to try to get him and uh, Nolan Ryan at, at the same time. I'm going to kind of grind those simultaneously. And really, I don't need a whole lot for the Nolan Ryan. I need to, to finish these two. I don't even know what they are, really. But uh, I'm pretty close to being done with the Brett Saberhagen and CC Sabathia programs. And then I'll just ha have the exchanges and these two missions to do. So I don't think that'll be that bad. And uh, But Ruth, I've got a long way to go for Ruth. So I might be able to get two pitchers done in that time. I don't know. I'm also really close on Ripken. And I've got a good bit of Larkin done as well. So... Uh, so, yeah, uh, Ripken is another guy that is probably going to be coming sometime soon. But, yeah, does the team look good? Team looks relatively good. Pretty happy with that. Do need to turn my headphones down, though. There we go. All right. Yeah, pitching, though, is, like, the big area where I need help right now. Like, my pitching is not good. What do you guys think about this Joe Maurer card that they came out with? Like, I like it, but now that I have Mike Piazza, I don't know. I, I mean, I, I'm going to try him out to see if I like him better because the Piazza hasn't just been fantastic for me. But uh, wait, where am I playing? Let's play Barnes Canyon. That's right, Barnes Canyon. I even forgot what stadium I play at. What's up, Mac David? What's going on, dude? The 200 innings pitch – is a grind wait do you have to do that for the nolan is that the ryan express is that is that what the mission is for him hey what's up uzi oh ruth ruth oh yeah 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 that's that's what I was saying. That one's gonna take me a while. Um, 
but yeah, the, the, the Ruth is going to be probably the longest. I, I haven't started on the Albert Bell or anything. I mean, I have a little bit done just from the sake of playing, but for the most part, I don't, I don't have much. But right now, having five immortals on the on the team, along with three of the really good career arcs, I mean that's that's a pretty solid lineup to roll out, you know. Yeah, for whatever reason, Piazza, I, I don't know if it's a swing or whatever, but he he just doesn't seem to have a ton of power, at least not relative to what his numbers are. Or at least so far, I, I don't have a huge sample with him, but so far that's by, been my impression. I really like this Carson Smith card, though. I've been rolling with him in the bullpen for for a, a few days, and uh, he's really good. I like that card. You have better with Gary, Gary Carter. I can see that. I hit really well. I hit really well with uh, with Johnny Bench too. I I like that card. I, that card is probably going to stay on my team all year just because he's such a super utility guy. Plays good defense, hits lefties fantastic, hits righties pretty good. I love that. I, it's probably – the Johnny Bench card is probably what uh, kept me from going for the Ben Zobris card. It's really all that Ben Zobris card has got over the bench is that he's a switch hitter and he can play middle infield. But it's, Oh, dude, I've never done that. I've never – Wow, what a start. I've never done that in my life. Every single time I rob a ball, it's like a home run. I've never done it on a foul ball. Have you guys ever done that? I didn't even think it was possible to do that. Wow, that was awesome. That was awesome. Okay, I'm kind of hyped about that. You're going to two, what concerts are you going to? If it's Primus and Mr. Bungle, then I would lose my fucking mind. But since Mr. Bungle isn't together anymore and Pri it's probably not Primus, you probably don't like Primus, I, it's, it's probably not that. So I'm not going to get my hopes up. Nobody's ever done that. Wow. That might have been a first. I, I might have just broke the game right there. Okay, Jackie Robinson debut right here. I like the big PCI, but, you know, he doesn't have a ton of power. Let's see what he can do. Nope. Nope. Not going for that. Going to check it. Oh, get by. Hey, dude, if, if he could just do that, just get, like, nice little dinky base hits, get lucky every now and then, I think he's going to be great for me because of that speed. I, I That's one thing that my team has kind of lacked so far this year is really good speed. So having him on at the top of the lineup is pretty nice. Ah, uh, now I'm going to have to go back because he kind of jammed me up there with Chipper. Hey, what's up, EJ? Ah, uh, crap. Try a lot, but you know you've never done it? Yeah. Okay, this guy, he he's going to keep me keep me honest over there, but I, I'm still, I'm, I'm going to steal with him. Or do a hit and run and hit one out. Stay fair. Stay fair. Stay fair. Stay fair. That's fair. That's got to be fair. That's got... Oh, come on, game. Guys, y'all saw that, right? You guys saw that. That was that that was on the right-hand side of the paw. I mean, it was right on it, but... It was more... Okay, Stan Musial debut right here. Beautiful. Ozzy Osbourne. Dude, that's... Those are not bad... That those are not bad concerts right there. I'd be super down for both of those. My mom is freaking in love with Elton John. Oh yeah, we stole that. We stole that all day. Yeah. Okay, let's see if Musial can get an RBI here. Oh, or just take the walk. You know, every now and then you got to take a walk. And then Mike Piazza pops out because he sucks. 
That's okay. We got runners on base. It's, it's a good omen. What's up, Christian? You love my mom? I love my mom, too. That's not weird at all. My mom's very lovable. Speaking of Anibal Sanchez, since uh, me and this guy are both pitching him, he's been amazing this year. Have any of you guys, I know not all you guys are Braves fans, but those of you who aren't, just go and look at Anibal Sanchez's statistics. Like, he went from basically being a player that needs to be, you know, like retiring to like one of the better pitchers in the National League this year. It's crazy. He's pitching so well for the Braves. Chipper, that was awful. That was so bad. Oh, man. I, di I didn't know that about you, Tim. I don't think you've ever told me that, that you were obsessed with Elton. Sometimes Chipper, especially on those choppers, it's like he just moves in slow motion. It's like he's in water trying to get the ball. He's like, blah, blah, blah. I don't know. He's not good defensively. I, lo I love having his bat in the lineup, but he is not good defensively. Might even be better in left field than he is at third base. But the thing is, is I put Mike Schmidt at third base too, and he's really not like a god over there or anything. He's just okay. Nice. That was a good pitch. Thank you, Jimmy. Thank you, Jimmy. Better in left. Yeah, I would I would imagine so. Okay, he's getting that extra step over there. He's getting a little frisky. Was that just was that just a one-time thing, homie? Really? Really? Splitter on the outside corner. You're just going to go ahead and pull that out of the yard, huh? That's what you're going to do with that pitch? Okay. Okay. I see you, OGT bag. And then you're just going to go ahead and get a hit with Anibal Sanchez there, aren't you? That's the game plan, huh? Don't, don't know if it's sustainable. You're so excited for Tuesday so you don't have to play this game. Oh, Josh. Always one for hyperbole. Wasn't Chipper good at defense? Chipper wasn't a terrible defender at third base, but he wasn't good. I, I, I would say that he was average. Like, I don't know. That was a good, like, era for, for third base defense, though. So, I, I don't know. He was he was probably right right around average his entire career. Maybe slightly below. Maybe slightly below. Or slightly above. I could see that too. There we go. That a boy Frank. The big hurt. Will I match up against you? I'm new to streaming but play often. Well, now that I'm... Whoa, dude, guys. Dude, thank you so much, man. That is That is lovely of you. Thank you, man. That's really, really nice. Wow. Holy shit, dude. I was not expecting that tonight. Um, but thank you. Uh, it, but Joshua, um, I will um, one day, now that I'm back, one day this week maybe we'll do viewer games or something, and uh, you can hop in a stream then and we can play. How's that sound? Get out get out that came off my bat real hard man damn it damn it fuck thank you josh 
Guys, dude, you're the man, dude. You are the man. Thank you so much. And thank all you guys for like all the kind words that you left on the uh, on the old on the old comment section today. That was super nice. Most of you, anyway. One guy called, told me that I, I think it was John told me a uh, told me I sounded like a broken record, which he's not wrong. He's really whoa, guys. What are you doing? Don't do that, dude. You've got kids. Think of the kids, man. Give that to the children in Africa. They need it, man. Holy cow, guys! Thank you so much, man. I really appreciate it. That's freaking awesome, dude. That is awesome. Now we got to make a comeback W for Gus here. Freaking donate in a 50 spot. Like a like a boss. <sighs> this guy's tough to strike out. Let's see if we can get him with a high cheese. $50, Gus. That's insane, bro. You're insane. Screw the kids. This is about Beanie. That's my motto, man. Just... Not screw the kids, but like piss off kid. <laughs> God, what a terrible motto that would be. Like there's no way that you could make it work good. Screw the kids. It's like either you mean it literally and you're a pedophile or you mean it like figuratively and you're a major asshole. See you, Nate. See you, buddy. You can't afford Madden. I'm gonna get it. I, I haven't gotten it yet. I'm gonna get it on the tenth. I'm gonna wait till the tenth to get it. I, I've heard good things uh, from most people, but I've heard some people say that that. As far as gameplay goes, like, there's still a little bit of buggy AI and, like, the quarterback does stupid shit. But I've heard it's a much more defensive-oriented game this year, which I like. I like games where it's really hard to score, but it's not incredibly hard to keep your opponent from scoring. I don't like games where it's basically, like, the first person to stop the other person wins. I, I, I hate those kind of Madden games. Ah, crap. <laughs> Figuratively, yes. Figuratively screw the kid. That, that's almost one of those phrases where putting the figuratively in front of it is almost like a must. It's like, man, screw the kids. Figuratively. Figuratively. Oh, come on. I hit that ball harder than that, damn it. I got some loft on it. Thank you, Scotty D. Means a lot, man. Get out. Stay fair. Stay fair, get out. Oh, fuck. I can't keep it fair. That guy hit a home run like that. Why can't I? Have you, Fernando? Has it been that good? See, I, I always, like, it's really, really hard for me to like a Madden more than, uh, than an MLB game simply because I just like baseball better than the NFL. Now, college football, if they came out with a college football game, I can go ahead and tell you guys right now, I would fucking abandon my channel uh, from, from like MLB and it would just be all NCAA. I'd play that shit all day. But, uh, in fact, I've really been thinking about trying to get a, get my hands on a PS, uh, on a PS three so I can play, uh, NCAA 14, the last, the last one. This guy just slide steps like a beast when there's a runner on base. Hey, I get a head start. Nice. 
god, that was fucking ball four too. Damn it. Dude, NCAA football with this like new generation, good lord, that game would be so good, man. Golly, just thinking about it. I, I know that they're coming out with like some fake college football game or something that I, but I think they're making it where you can uh where you can like create real schools and like make leagues and stuff with real schools in it, but you have to do it on your own. So it has to be kind of like the OSFM roster vault, you know, like somebody would have to create it on their own and then upload it to a vault that we can download it from. Um, that, that sounds like a great idea and like a really good workaround. But in, there's just something about the, the EA Sports iteration. It's like the only EA Sports game that I've consistently liked every year. Yeah, Josh, Madden is so realistic. Oh my god. It, it was so realistic. They were like basically the same games with the same engine. Like... Madden would always stay like one year up to date on NCAA, but if you played like Madden 12, the gameplay was super similar to NCAA 13. You know what I mean? Like, like it was it was always one year behind Madden. It seemed like, but it wasn't a fucking arcade game, dude. Get the fuck out of here. You you like to you like to put hyperbole into everything, Josh. Everything. It, n nothing can just be as it is. Nothing. Like every like MLB is a pretty bad game and it's literally worse than No Man's Sky. It's the worst game ever made. It is wor worse than that fucking what was it? What was that terrible game? Like that was it ET or Ghostbusters or something like that back in the 80s that everyone shits on as the worst game of all time? No, fuck that. It's freaking it's freaking MLB. Dude, Josh, you just you've got to get the uh, the sliders right, dude. Um, there was a there was a downloadable uh, slider thing on NCAA 14 that made the gameplay really really balanced, like really balanced. Where, I, like, I had no complaints at all. I had game I, I could play a 15 minute quarter game, and the score end up being pretty reasonable, like 31 to 24 or something like that. It, it, it like you just had the two it wasn't built into the defaults that I, I do agree with that but there were ways to tune that game and really optimize it freaking fifty dollars from gusto i can't get over that thank you man god dang it you know that guy freaking pulled that splitter he pulled it on the outside corner and the wind is blowing directly in the opposite direction of which he hit it. That's terrible. E.T. Yeah, E.T. It was E.T. That's right. Yeah, dude. With, with uh, Honestly, though, you have to do that with Madden, too. Like, you have to set the, the sliders just exactly how you want it. If you want a balanced offline gameplay, it's unfortunate that you can't do that online. Um, but I mean, for obvious reasons, you can't. But uh, but yeah, it, it, offline, if you tune it just right, the gameplay will be pretty good. The one, the one big complaint that I've always had with football games has been the blocking. It's like guys get sucked into blocks and they can only get out of it with an animation. It's not like they don't have a real good physics engine yet that that cover that makes blocking uh, realistic. You know what I mean? Um, that that's always been my big complaint with uh, with with all 3D football games. Is that block and, and blocking causes everything else to get out of wonk too? Like the running game is kind of wonky, almost always. Um, you know, the, the they have to artificially slow down receiver routes because the pass rush doesn't get in as quick as it does in real life. It's just dumb. She love how I'm 
Betty's a love with my rocket ship. And she called me Zaddy and she got a fatty and she's so provocative. I'm torn and QB vision thing where you had to look at your receivers. Had no idea until watching a stream that they got rid of it. Wait, Andrew, are you talking about the fucking cone thing that they had like way back in like 2005? Is that what you're talking about? Like 13 years ago? The, the little thing where the rest of the field was like dark and then you had like one little like like cone of light and you had to move that to the receiver before you could throw it to it to it i actually thought that would i, I thought it was pretty well done but i can see why some people would hate it but damn dude that's crazy that you didn't know they took that away until 13 years later <laughs> that's crazy man I can't time up that slider right now I'm either way too early on it or way too late yeah that was a long time ago I can't imagine I can't imagine being so pissed about this one feature of a video game that you literally just check out for 13 years and you're just like fuck it if this is part of the game now fuck this game and then it takes you 13 years to realize that it was like a one-year experiment. And you've missed out on 12 iterations of Madden because of that. <laughs> Damn, Andrew. <laughs> you saw that fucking you saw that fucking little cone and you were like, nope, fuck this. I'm out. I'm out. See you, EA. I'm freaking, I'm going over to 2K5, and then 2K5 ends, and you're just like, I guess I'm done with football video games. I can't deal with it anymore. And you didn't ask one person, is this still a thing? Like, it never crossed your mind again for 13 years. That's so funny to me. I don't know why. <laughs> yeah, you did, you did save a pretty penny out of that. <laughs> Should I sell, chat, sell Chapman? And Ramirez get player of the month Carpenter. Ooh, that's a that's a steep price to pay for for that one player. I really do like that um, that Carpenter. I, I really do. I think that's a, an excellent card. But ooh, no, I I don't think so. I don't think so, Tyler. That's that's a really steep price. Yeah, I yeah, I remember that. Like there were some guys, like the really good quarterbacks, they had uh their cones were freaking enormous. Like it, it it wasn't even a big deal at all for them. Like it was basically just whether you were looking left or right, because the center was almost always covered. But then you had some like really bad quarterbacks where their cone was almost non existent. Some up, what's it happening? Okay. Dude, I can't wait until like ev basically everywhere gets gets top shelf internet. You know, like out in the country and stuff, like you can get really good internet. I can't wait until that day. I, I heard I had an, a guy from AT&T over here the other day installing some backup internet for me. And uh and he was talking about this new company that is trying to run internet through through the power lines. And if that ever happens, if they can figure out how to do that, that'll open up everything. That would be amazing. Golly, I pulled down just a little bit. God, man, it's so sensitive so sensitive i mean i definitely was off right there but yeah that's about right but like last year that that would have been a, a freaking shot because the pci wasn't so sensitive hey turbulent what's going on dude thank you man Okay, Stan has, what, a walk and a fly out so far? Oh, just early. 
Get out. No, what? No. R Ramon's fucking with me right now. Black Ghost, thank you for the subscription, man. Really appreciate it. Hey, thank you, uh, Jeremy. Yeah, dude, I've got to get back to the reviews. I've also probably need to kill off the top 10 list. Oh, that was a good play. Damn it. Um, but yeah, I also need to kill off the top 10 list. Uh, I think I still have center field left. And then I'll really want to redo it with all the immortals and all the new cards that we have in and everything. So, yeah, I've got, I've got a lot of stuff to do here in the next like week to catch up yeah Andrew um the guy was saying that they're not quite there yet but that, that but he he said it's like a, a few years away like not not it's not gonna be something that that's you know 20 years out or something that is coming pretty soon I didn't understand, like, all the techie stuff involved. Damn it. Why did I throw that pitch? Why, why the fuck? It was a stupid pitch. I don't know why I did that. Now he's going to pull Sanchez, of course. Oh, you get, make that play, Jackie. I got you for a reason. Nice. Turbulent, yeah, dude. I I think it, I, you know, even though I, I didn't intend to do it, I do think that it will be a net positive for the channel for me. Um, you know, just kind of giving myself a little room to breathe. Now we got a freaking wife beater up here. About to close the game out on me. I'm just trying to get under Jersey's skin. Oh, damn it. What's up, Bullet? Nice, nice. A depressing fact that how many Joshes do you know that are older than 55? Joshua. I, I don't know. That's a weird fucking question. Like, I don't, I don't know. It's not something I've ever thought about. I don't really know that many people over the age of 55, in all honesty. Like, outside of my family, anyway. Like, honestly, how many people over the age of 55 do you guys know that aren't members of your family? Can't be that many. That was a good pitch. Uh, yeah, let's, let's go, Billy. Get out. Stay fair. Stay fair. Tie ball game. Suck my dick. Whew. Don't chirp, Asuna. <laughs> I did, I thought it was a great trade, honestly. Like, everybody up here moralizing, like, how could they? How could they, the Astros? How could they trade for that guy? It's like, dude, he's fucking awesome. Are you kidding me? It's like, yeah, it doesn't, I mean, it didn't hit you. Why do you care? <laughs> hey, what's up, Beetle Bomb? Okay. Let's go with Carson. Turbulent. Yeah, man. I mean, I know a lot of people go through shit and everything. I just, I don't know. It, it Like, every now and then, like, I just, you know, I just have a, have a fucking phase. You know what I mean? And I got to deal with it. That's what I'm, that's what I'm doing. Nice. 
nice. Dude, this Carson Smith is nasty, y'all. Y'all don't even know. Just because he's a gold, a lot of you guys are just dissing him and being like, oh, Carson Smith, he's, he's below average. He's not. He's well above it. <laughs> What's up, Colossal? I missed you too, man. I missed all you guys. I just, for like a month or two, I hated you. And that's why I didn't upload. Kidding. It's too much bat. Wait. Urban to keep his job? For Urban? Oh, the, the Astros. G what, is it, what is his name? Dick Urban? Is that his name? I know I've read it. I just, I, it didn't connect with me that that was the guy. I mean, honestly, Andrew, I mean, maybe, but like if, if they win the world series and he pitches well, I, I mean, Araldus Chapman did the same thing and Theo Epstein still has his, has his job. You know what I mean? So I, I don't know. I think a lot of it just depends on how they do. I mean, that guy has built a freaking perennial winner. Oh, dude, that's so fucking weird. Okay, I thought you said, uh, like, I just quickly read it, and I thought you said Osuna. I didn't, I, <laughs> I didn't realize you were talking about Ohio State and friggin' Urban Meyer. Yeah, that, that Urban's an, an ass, too. Guy from Astro is probably isn't even close to Urban. It's probably, like, fucking, like, some bitch or something. I don't know. <laughs> hey, we got the lead, by the way. But yeah, honestly, the same thing f f with Urban. Like, I, I, I mean, I know he's probably not coming back, but I don't know. Like, do you think if Nick Saban, like, if he had like a little scant, like, I don't know. I don't know, man. I guess it depends on how big. And college is a lot different, so maybe. Maybe it's a lot easier to get into, like, really hot water over shit like that in college, it seems like. Do I think the Cubs can win the World Yes, I think the Cubs can win the World Series. They're not my pick, though. Dude, Soup, what's up, man? I'm glad you stopped by tonight. How are you, dude? Guys, by the way, I don't know if you guys noticed, but you know, you remember how I always say that I'm the clutchest channel on, on YouTube? You guys remember that I was like down by two runs just a second ago and I just took the lead? It happens every game. Like, first six innings, I'm terrible. But in those like seventh, eighth, ninth, I'm unstoppable. But yeah, the Cubs can win. I just. Honestly, I don't think. I, I, it's hard for me to say that anybody from the National League is like the favorite to win the world series. I just think the AL is probably going to be too strong, but, uh, the Dodgers, sir. I, I mean, if there is any team that is a favorite out of the NL is the Dodgers just because, I mean, good Lord, they added so many wins with, uh, with Machado, with Dozier, even Axford is probably going to be kind of helpful. You know what I mean? crap what division oh uh th I, this is my first game of uh this ranked season so 650 rating what is that division series or or regular season is that a is that a thing re re regular season is that a division i forget there's so many divisions now i liked it back when it was just like dscs and world series 
Now you've got like the disabled list. You've got arbitration, spring training. Uh, you've got freaking players to be named later, teams to be named later. Wild card, yeah, that's that's it. Wild card. Before that is it, what is it? Regular season, and then before that's like spring training. And then before that, the disabled list. That's what, honestly, that's what they should call it. If you can't, if you can't make it to spring training, they just need to call whatever is below that the disabled list. That's what they need to call it. Or like the the Cape Cod League. That that's what you're you're in the Cape Cod League. Of the oh, it is the first division of the ones I said. I can't remember. Used to it was like spring training. DS or wild card? No, 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 no. They didn't have wild card. Spring training, DS, CS, or then World Series. I think maybe regular season was in there at some point. I want to look at the divisions. Hold up. What do they have? They really need to have the disabled list in there, though. That's going to be a suggestion. A suggestion uh, to the devs. <laughs> One of them is really dumb. One of them is insanely stupid. What, can, can you guys guess which one I think is insanely stupid? Which one does Beanie think is insanely stupid? Like, like whoever came up with the idea needs to be fired on the spot. It's so dumb. absolutely the pennant race 100% the pennant race that's not even a fucking thing that's, that's just like like at least the all-star thing is like it has a game involved in it like the pennant race is just like this this esoteric thing that we say like like are the pirates in the pennant race right now nobody knows it's just like some thing that we say it doesn't mean anything at all and yet we attach that to like this division that has concrete boundaries around it. The pennant race is ridiculous. If anything, it should be a part of just like the regular season. I can see an all-star is really dumb too, though. Like the all-star division, like, like that has nothing to do with anything. Yeah. Pennant race and all-star gotta go. If you want to keep wild card, I'm fine with it. It makes some sense. Spring training makes sense, even though I would change it to the disabled list. <laughs> uh, regular season, fine. Wild card division, championship, World Series, perfect. All star and pennant race, you got to go. You got to get out of here. You got to get out of here. DFA, <laughs> designate for assignment, yeah. Now, I like the disabled list because just like if, if you consistently play this game, there's got to be something wrong with you that you can't make it out of spring training. And if any of you guys watching haven't made it out of spring training, seriously, come and tell me and like send me a screenshot and I will sit down and play with you for like a couple hours just to get you out of that godforsaken division because there is no reason, no reason to be on the disabled list in MLB The Show. Yes, BCAM, I, I would be 100% in favor of that move. <laughs> yeah, it, it, the, the All-Star Division also doesn't make any sense because it's the third lowest division on the thing. Like, it's, it, you know, it, whenever you think of like, oh, I'm, I'm in the All-Star Division, I'm an All-Star at this game. You think, oh man, this guy must be pretty good. No, he's not fucking good. He's awful. This guy, this guy is barely competent at the game, and yet he gets to slap the all-star label on himself. How freaking millennial is that? How freaking everybody gets a trophy at that is that? Like the bottom two percent in this game get to call themselves all-stars. Well, I have to call myself the World Series. Do you, Charlie Culberson was in the World Series last year. You realize that, right? It's not like 
terrible, terrible players have, have been to the World Series. Not that many bad players have been to the All-Star game. I don't know. I'm ranting at this point. <laughs> oh, my God. It's such a stupid system. Go back. Go back to just whatever we had before that was that that wasn't stupid what did josh say I think the Cubs are going to the World Series. Whenever whoever comes out of the, the AL will be tough to beat. I, the the Cubs are probably my number two team out of the NL, followed by the probably golly, probably followed by the Brewers, and then I think the I think the Braves, Phillies, and Diamondbacks are all pretty close behind those three. But but honestly, all six of those teams have really good shots, my in my opinion. But okay, do we want to play uh, battle royale? Try to get that Carter Caps, or do we want to play another ranked seasons game? It's up to you guys. Do you want to play some more with Jackie and Stan? Uh, you know, give them another game after their debut, or do you guys want to? Uh, ride this battle royale team as far as we can. Ranked, got to vote for ranked. Uzi, you are not in spring training. I've played you before. You're a hundred percent better than spring training. Yeah, Andrew Gold, but they're not like completely incompetent players, like. At least relative to the MLB standard, at least that was the best player on a bad team. You know what I mean? But I get, but I, but point taken. Ranked, ranked, ranked. Br, get that Tiant. Okay, so three to one. If you, if you guys, if if you guys have a preference, I would type it in now. I'm gonna give you guys like 15 seconds. Any clue to on the next event? No clue. You're oh, you're oh and oh, okay. <laughs> but I did I did make the contingent that if you consistently play the game, you know what I mean. All right, looks like looks like it's gonna be ranked. I need to get that straw poll website. All right, we'll play some ranked. We'll do uh, we'll do BR uh, next stream or something, or maybe a little bit after after this game or something. Oh. Gus, are you still here, man? I wanted to say bye to you and thank you for uh, for the fifty spot before you left. BR, BR, rank, BR. Oh, uh, we already got an opponent. We're playing ranked. Guys, I love this freaking vape thing, dude. I, I, I really want to get like a, a, a nicer vape. And, uh, and, and you know, that that just like on the front end is, is more expensive, but on the back end is cheaper. At least that's how I kind of understand it so far. But the problem is that, like, I've fallen in love with this particular flavor, which it, it's called Gold Leaf. And, and it's uh, it's with the blue uh, cigs. They come, like, in pods. They have different flavors. And, and Gold Leaf is one of them. And I've become, like, addicted to the flavor of it. It's so good. It tastes like coffee or something. Oh. Oh. I'm, just, I'm too nice, man. I'm too nice. I'll give that guy one friendly. If we get another one, I'm not taking it. 
Immortals have kind of ruined a lot of that, though, because, like, it, it, if somebody sees a team with, like, way more Immortals than they do, than they have, then they, they just, you know, ask for a friendly. And I'm so nice that I give it to them. That, and I don't want, you know, horrific messages sent to me after the game. Joshua, it's kept me off of them for about, uh, God, almost a month now. Um, well, like t two and a half, three weeks. He must have, yeah, he probably did. He probably bought Dave. I think almost everybody in the world that made the World Series ended up selling that card. Damn, this guy goes heavy live series, though. We're going to be facing Clayton. Uh-oh. Yeah, no, not everybody with an Immortal is good. That's that's a very fair point. But, you know, it's it's I, I guess it's just an indication that, one, your team is really good, and, two, that you've played the game a lot. So the odds of you being good, I guess, are maybe better. Okay. Last one, I promise, guys. But see, I'm, I'm, I'm just like, this is a problem. Like, it takes us a minute to find a game. Last one, though, I promise. Honestly, I just really didn't want to face Kershaw there. If he, I wasn't gonna offer it, but if he offered it, I, I, I was gonna take it. I didn't. Kershaw versus Sutton. That's not really a great matchup for me. Immortal? No, I don't think Immortals run the game. Um, souvenirs were bad. I, I don't know if souvenirs are in the game, but I don't think I don't think immortals or souvenirs are particularly good for the game. Um I think team balance right now is a major, major issue for for guy for people that got immortals. It's I mean there's there's no reason to play anyone else. And and that takes a lot of the fun out of Diamond Dynasty. One of the fun parts of Diamond Dynasty is like you know picking like you know, picking the right guys that fit on your team well and, you know, like having to, to give something up to get something in return and stuff like that. And the Immortals just kind of take that out of the equation. Sparky, dude, what's up, man? How are you? How are you, man? Okay, we are not taking a friendly quit right here. I promise. I promise, promise, promise. Yeah, that uh, honestly, Sean, that's that's probably the uh, the solution is just to to put out a crap ton of Frank Thomases. Basically, we need a better Roberto Alomar card. If they put out a, a really good Roberto Alomar card, I would probably use that card to replace Jackie. Honestly, um. But yeah, we, we need we just need better cards. Hazel Odd Man 29 just sub, dude. Thank you so much for the sub. Really awesome. Chipper is good. I love the chipper man. Ooh. Ooh. That was a nasty pitch. If you could throw that pitch all game, I'd have no chance. Yeah, Sparky. I do, I, do, I do that all the time. This time was a little more serious, though. Like, every now and then I'll just kind of have ebbs and flows, and it'll cause me to take like a day or two off. But this last one, I just kind of I kind of hit a wall, you know what I mean? And I had to claw myself out of it mentally. And uh, but I but I have I'm good I'm good everything everything is Gucci. Fucking twenty eight I don't need to be saying that word anymore. Oh good hit I like this Robinson y'all I really do it, it's it's a really compelling card doesn't have the most power and and that'll probably make me hate it eventually but for for the time being I dig it.
I'm going to take two pitches here before I decide to steal. Okay, I, God, that was a really good pitch there. Just wanted to make sure. Oh, and of course he does. How do they know? How do they know I'm about to go? I didn't take an extra step or anything. What a fucking clairvoyant. Going this time, homie. Okay. Not going this time. Oh, God. This is going to be one of those guys. Damn it. I don't like this game because I want contact speed defense players to matter. Yeah. It does suck that those guys don't. But honestly, Josh, like that's kind of been a problem for a couple years now. The power has just been kind of kind of OP. But the difference is is that um you also needed contact and vision. Like that was super important to go along with it. And now Oh, we pulled him off. Nice. And now it doesn't. It, it feels like you can get by with with all power, and, and you'll be okay. I, I still think the contact and vision are important, but you can't like if you have a guy that's just contact and like just a little bit of power. It's it's hard to make them work. That's why I am a little skeptical of the Robinson, but right now I'm buying in. Nineteen, nineteen likes. Wait, what? I don't even. Yeah, guys, if you could hit the like button, that would be amazing. Really, really helps out the channel, especially whenever I'm a piece of crap and take a month off. Those likes really do help, like a ton. Okay, I wonder, would he throw to third? Would he dare? Or just do that? What happened? Safe. Beautiful. It's exactly what I wanted to happen. I, see, I would have thrown to second there. That's what I would have done. But he decided to throw to third. And now we got the bases loaded. Now a fly ball does a lot for us. But... I would rather have the lefty up here, in all honesty. This. This right here happens way too much. The pop fly. Way too much. Way. Like, oh. The, mm, way too much. Like, sometimes it really feels brutal. It's like almost impossible not to pop that pitch up. Like, getting your PCI perfectly right there. Good God. And that's not going to do it, is it? Nope. What a wasted opportunity. Damn it. Oh, shit. Has the game been this way? Power over contact since PCI? Uh, I don't, I don't really know if there's any correlation between that. I don't think so because we had the PCI back in MLB 15 and 16. And I don't really, I don't really remember it being that big of a problem until 17 and this year. And God, we've had the PCI for years. So... It's just not everybody really used it in surplus until the past few, you know. Hey, what's up, uh, Kenny Powers? Glenn, what's going on, bro? 
Italian Stallion, Adam Rickards, everybody, dude, everybody just hopped in all of a sudden. Anybody else? Yeah, that's that 2016 Ichiro was amazing. I hated last year that they locked him behind uh, the AL West collection. That I hated that. In in 16, wasn't he like a freaking conquest reward or something like that? Golly, really? Where did I put that ball? Let's see. Yeah, okay. I can buy that. I didn't get it down far enough. Sparky, dude. Thank you, man. Welcome back. Been wanting. Hold up. Been wanting to do this as a thanks for 1K, so it looks like tonight's the night. Dude, thank you so much, Sparky. It means the world to me, man. And I'm so glad that your channel is freaking blowing up, dude. I love it. I love it, man. You'll be you'll you'll be at 2K in no time, dude. It'll be like the blink of an eye. Oh my god, dude. What the hell, dude? You guys really wanted me back, huh? It's freaking like, hey, what is that, 80 bucks tonight? Adam, dude, thank you so much. He says, welcome back. Dude, thank you, man. Thank you. Holy cow. I'm like flustered. Thank you so much, man. You and Sparky. Adam, have you ever thought about uh, starting a channel or anything like that? You have the personality for it. I don't know if you do, like, in front of, like, a camera or anything. I I I've just never seen it. Dude, Sparky has been murdering it. You guys are typing at the same time. Yeah, dude. Oh, get off the wall at least. Come on. I just don't get any power on anything. I don't know if it's because I'm not as precise as I used to be because of how just like hypersensitive the PCI is. Who do I think is going to win the NL Central? Right now my bet is on the Cubs, but uh, I think the Brewers are... At this point, I, I'm going to call them not a lot, but my favorite for sure to, to, get, to grab a wild card. Definitely. Um, even though I'm really not that big of a fan of what they did at the deadline. Like, yeah, they got a lot of, got a lot of power. But that infield defense, it's like, what are you going to do? You know? I mean, obviously we have the answer to that, but... I don't know. It has the potential of going very, very bad poorly. You know what I mean? Oh, look at Kluber. And he's literally about to get run. To oh, my God. <laughs> you see how long it took, it, it took him to get to first base? Good Lord. Do more videos. Editing is comparable to the trip to the dentist for me. But I'll get there. I got you, dude. Time is an issue for sure. When work is over, I'm wiped out. You don't know how Sparky does it. I got you, Adam. I do. Well, dude, I, I think you should if, if you ever get the chance to. Because personality wise, you're like, you're, you'd be great at it. But, uh, yeah, if you ever need, like, any help with, like, setting up anything or anything of that nature, let me know. Yeah, the Braves game today was crazy. Indeed. Oh, no. Okay. 
The Braves just have a penchant this year for, for like, late-inning heroics. It's honestly kind of been that way ever since Brian Snicker got here. Like, the seventh, eighth, and ninth inning is always is, is when the Braves do their best work. Cam, am I using? I'm using a Logitech, uh, like, 420... I think Logitech 420, I think, is the number. I know it's a Logitech. I just, I don't exactly remember, like, the model number. It was, like, a year and a half ago when I bought it. Hey, what's up, Hunt? What's going on, bro? The chances the Yankees don't make the playoffs, I... Pretty low, in my opinion. I think think the Yankees are going to get it. Um, like, I don't know what are like how like who's the next closest team behind them in the Mariners? Is it like the Angels or the or the Twins or the like? I don't even know who it is. Like, I checked out of that race so long ago. Just because it, it, it just seems so locked up, you know. Hunt, you hit a K? Dude, you went ahead and hit a K, huh? Nice, man. Congrats, dude. That uh, that four-digit mark, man. That's a, that's a tough, tough threshold to climb. But you and Sparky, y'all are over it. Finally, like, what was wrong with that game? Like, yeah, like, are you just basically telling him right now that he can throw screwball after screwball, and no matter what I do, I'm just gonna fly out? Is is, is that the message that you're sending, or knuckle Kurt, whatever? Like that 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 was good input. It was really good input. Or just line out right to his guy. I don't fucking know. Oh, fucking oh my god. Lots of mods right now. Jesus. James, James is not lying. Hey, what up, Obliterator? You just want to go by Zoe now. You're cool. So, so it's just going to be Zoe. Y'all hit it the same night? Dude, that's that's pretty cool. I think me and Duck... I think Duck was like a, a couple weeks behind me. But Duck hit it pretty close to around the same time that I did as well. Ah, damn it. Oh, yeah, 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 Joshua. I, I use OBS, Open Broadcast Software, and an Elgato uh, uh, capture card. Costs like 130, 140 bucks for the, for the Elgato. And I think, I think OBS is free. Wait, 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 Adam, what are you asking again? Uh, let's go with a curveball. I should, uh, I should put, like, all of my, all, all the equipment and stuff that I use in, uh, in, like, the description or, or something and just, like, save it as a default description so that if anybody is curious or anything like that they can just refer to that all right <laughs> wait 
<laughs> Did you just say that you... Dude, when I hit 1k, I think I nutted. Well, actually, now that I think about it, I really don't think I did. Now, now, now that I had time to ponder it over, I don't think I ejaculated when I hit 1k. I think it was sometime later. That cutter is a nasty pitch, man, if you can locate it. All right. Yeah, the ch I, I just got like a quick chub and then it went away. I, I don't know how to combat this right now. I'm at a I'm at a loss. Is that like maybe get no? Okay. All right. I see you, game. Like I'm good. I'm good. Everything right now. Good timing. Like, my PCI is ballparking the ball every time. It's just not going anywhere. That, that was my fault. That wasn't a good one. I'll admit it. I'm not above my mistakes. No, Jacob, I have not gotten Ripken yet, but I do have Stan Musial and uh, and Jackie. I got them the other day. Cal is... Uh, I'm really close to Cal, so he might be next, but the, but the guy that I'm really targeting right now is Ruth. At least he's throwing some, like, mixing up some pitches here and there. Oh, early? Okay. Oh! Oh, son! Son, Duke Snyder, he ain't no bitch. I would, I would not do that again. Uh, soon, yes. Um, now, now that I'm back to a regular, you know, regular stream and everything, yes, we will be doing viewer games soon. Okay. Sparky, are you playing like men's league uh, baseball right now? That's awesome if you are. I didn't know that. I wish we had some leagues around here. For whatever reason, we just don't do it, man. It's like you're playing affiliated ball or you or you aren't playing shit. Dude, that's freaking awesome, Sparky. It just sucks, dude, because once you get out of, like, you know, high school, college, or if you're lucky enough, you know, minor league, once you get out of that, we have one semi-pro team where basically they win like the national championship every year and if you aren't if you aren't like uh, uh, at least like a like an older single A caliber player, you know what I mean? If you aren't that caliber, you can't make the team. And that's basically all we have. Like we don't have any solid men's leagues or even any like men's travel teams or anything like that. We don't have any of that.
At least as far as I know. Hey, Yankee Films, dude. Sorry, I didn't see your thing. Thank you, man. Oh, shit. That could have been trouble. All right. We got to hit this guy, dude. But we're starting out with our pitcher and then Jackie. Yeah, I would say, like, I'm probably beyond capability of playing right now. But I would say, like, in my prime, you know, I was like a Juco level, like a mediocre Juco level player. But, like I said, I'd be fucking awful if I got out there right now. You know, I really, honestly, I don't know why we don't have any leagues like that around here, though. Because we have so many, like, former, like, minor league and college players around here. Like, in the Pine Belt of Mississippi, baseball is, is like, it. Like, it's it's right up there with football in, in popularity, you know what I mean? Oh, my God. I've been swinging at that all game. How can I not time that up? Come on. I cannot believe that I'm that I'm playing this bad against Don Sutton. Oh, there we go, base hit all day. I'm about to steal with Chipper. Let's see if I can make it. I mean, I need to get runners in scoring position. Didn't work out. It was close. Didn't work out. I mean, I like, I'm not hitting home runs right now, so I've got to rely on getting runners in scoring position and hoping that I can drive them in, you know. Get lucky with a base hit or two and drive them in. Nice. Jeff Clement, yes. I have. Hey, thank you, Rebecca. I got your message. Uh, that was super nice, Rebecca. Thank you. Damn it. Ugh. Oh, no. Don Sutton's not bad. I don't think that Don Sutton card is bad at all. Fact. I would venture to say he's pretty darn good. Two. Shit. All right, this is bad. This is real bad. We're going to go... We're going to go halfway here. Okay. Let's go four-seamer super high. All right, and now let's go four seamer super high again. Hey, that kind of worked out. Now we got Giancarlo. All right, this could be a terrible idea. Mm, I want to pop up. Give me a pop up. Nope. Okay, we got to get a C Reich three then. Nope. Uh, let's try it one more time. 
Yes. No, no. No, you fuck. Okay, okay. Hey, 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 we're good. This guy tried to get cheesy as shit. No, sir. He screwed up. We got out of the inning, baby. And would $50 be enough to finish it? Maybe if you put in buy orders. Yeah. That would have been a base hit without the shift. But yeah, if you, if you put in buy orders, that should probably be around enough. Um, how many stubs would that get you? I don't even know. I mean, I assume it would be something like 50,000 plus a bonus of like 10 or 15,000. Hey, I'd take a walk here. take it you're deadly with stanton i just don't like the tiny pci man i'm not good with it no 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 go back it hit my guy i needed that to bounce and get away Whew. Where'd the chat go? It was it, it was going pretty quick, and now nobody's chatting. I don't get it. No, not quite enough. Damn it! Yeah, I'm still alive, right? Okay, there we go. Twerk for subs, that's pretty funny. Wait, how the fuck did I get the third right there? What, ha what, what, what happened that last play? I wasn't even looking. And then I was flustered at the play. Oh, okay. You're just lurking. Okay, I got you. I got you. All right, guys. We got nine outs to score a fucking run. We have... How many hits do we have? Okay, just four. I thought we had like five or six. But still, we got to string a couple together. All right, let's go with that high fastball again. He seems to he seems to like to swing at that pitch. Ah, too high. All right, this should get him. All right, I'll take that. That gets him out in front. He doesn't like that cutter. JD is the guy that got me. He JD Martinez has been the difference in this game. I made a mistake in the first inning. Can't let JD beat me. Nice. That ooh, that's a wicked pitch. All right. Got to make sure I get this on the outside. Wow. How did he hit that? Me too, Hunt. What's up, Tay? You 
you want my take. Okay. Let me. If the Rockies miss the playoffs, does Arenado opt out? And B, is Jeff British fired for lack of activity at the deadline? Uh, if, if they miss the playoffs, yes, I think he'll be fired. But for, for a variety of reasons, not, not just being inactive at the deadline. Um, but Arenado, does Arenado have an option? Does he have an opt out? I, I would imagine if if he has a player option, I would imagine yes. But but I I wasn't aware that he had one. What's up, the Grooch? What up, dog? My game plan has kind of changed into just get Don Sutton off the mound. I was trying to foul that off. Damn it. He doesn't. He has an opt out this year. Next year, his contract is. Are you sure? I thought he was going into his last year of arbitration. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe maybe you're right. Well, if he has an opt out, I would say yes. Depending on the amount, what's the amount for? What's the opt out amount? Go, go to Spot Rack. Type in Nolan Arenado contract, and it should take you to a website called Spot Rack. And it should tell you. Come on, Mike. Yes. Yes. Okay. Okay, all right. So uh, let's bring on Billy Williams here. I, I, I would give the Braves, considering that I think they improved their team by a solid two to three wins and didn't give up anybody from, I, from what I would consider to be their top 15 prospects, I would give them an A-. minus. Like, the only reason it's not an A-plus is because they didn't get a left-handed infield option, and I thought that that was kind of important. But other than that, I thought it was a solid A. What we do here is go back, 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 back. And the only prospect of note that they gave up was uh, Giancarlo Encarnacion. Everybody else was just kind of meh, you know. And getting back Kevin Gosman, who has, like, number three upside, maybe even number two if he, you know, can kind of break out. Yeah. Getting Adam Duvall, who has some pop. Getting a couple situational bullpen options. I thought it was good. Really good. It's ARB4. Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. I was thinking he had one more arbitration year. That's right. Fuck. Okay, we still got Chipper up, though. Shit. We've got Sutton over a hundred pitches, though. Like, get out! Ugh! He made a mistake. Finally, he threw a fastball in the strike zone in my wheelhouse. Finally, thank God! As soon as that fastball was coming in, I was like, "Okay, we got the lead." Beautiful, clutchest channel on YouTube. I told you guys, seventh, eighth, and ninth. Just like the Braves, those are my innings. You get one through six, I get seven through nine. It's the way it works. You got you better you better build up your lead one through six. Hey, what's up, Ant? Guys, I, I just gotta say for all of you who are here. 
thank you, man. I, I honestly thought since I had taken so much time off that I was expecting like maybe 20 people to be here tonight. But I looked earlier. Hold up. And uh, we had like 39 people. Now we have 42. That's amazing, guys. I can't believe that I have this many people in here after taking off for so long. And did I get another one? Did I get another one? Is this game now five? Guys, one through six? That's You got to beat me one through six. You're not beating me seven, eight, nine. It's not happening. It ain't happening. You got to beat me one through six. You got to. Randy, dude, congrats, man. Ruth, uh, Ruth looks amazing. Yeah, 125 viewer commitment. I got to say, man. It really is. But all right, let's close this down. We're, we're to our bullpen. Kluber did a good job. He got us here. Now we got Britain. I dude, this Britain card has been nasty for me. I'm glad I kept him. Oh. Okay, he's going with Mur with Murph Dog. Alright. Okay, let's see how you respond to this pitch. Okay. All right, I, I, I'd be kind of afraid to throw that in the zone. I kind of, I'm kind of glad I missed a little bit with that pitch. You're gonna keep Utley in. Okay. Just gonna go for the tag here. And then Hanley doesn't hit lefties all that well. I do not like how this guy has constructed his lineup. Like, the entire middle of his lineup is very, very, very susceptible to left-handed pitching. He has three or, like, three or four straight lefties and then a righty who hits righties better with the reverse platoon splits. It's not the way to construct a lineup. It's poor lineup theory, my dude. Yeah, yeah, he had 103. That's what I was saying, dude. He had left uh, Sutton in there for a hot minute. But he also made a really bad mistake. I don't know why he was ever throwing a four-seamer. Like, maybe the sinker, but not the four-seamer. Oh, oh, oh. I just whiffed right through that, didn't I? Good timing, too. I just missed. I just feel like nobody really understands me, you know? It's like I constantly play this game in my head. Like, I, I think I'm better than I'm not. All right. Oh, my God. Uh, I hate being early. Okay, I got Golly. Like, MLB did this weird thing, man, where MLB 15, they trained me to be lightning quick. And I loved it. I loved having to be super quick to hit the ball. And then they slowed it down a little bit in 16, just a little. And I, I was like, Arr. but I still had to be lightning quick. And then 17, they slowed it down a good bit. But it was still, like, reasonable. And now they've just slowed it down to a point, or at least the timing window, They've slowed down to a point where it's just it's it's unreasonable at this point. Oh, that's called tunneling right there. You were thinking sinker. You were thinking it was gonna sink back down in there, but it didn't. Bases loaded, no outs to the Yankees score. I think the MLB average for those situations is around like 55% of the time the team scores. And the Yankees, I would say, would probably do that 
an above average amount of times. So I would say that the Yankees score there like 62% of the time. So more than likely, yeah. Ooh. Oh, that was good, aggressive base running right there. Kudos. Kudos, my dude. Oh. Uh, we gotta dig this down low. Not low enough. They got two on an error. Nice. Well, not really. I like. I hate the Yankees, but cool. I suppose. All right. All right, we got Britton up. He's got to. Okay, he's going to bring in Jake McGee. So we are going to go to uh, Johnny or Dale. Oh, let's go Johnny. Why not? I think we got this game. We do need to. No, nah, we got Jake and Trevor up. We're fine. Let's go. Let's go, homie. Nope. For one ranked game about a month ago, and the pitch feed felt insanely fast. Dude, download, uh, download like fifteen, and just play offline. It, it's lightning. I mean, you have to just be so absurdly quick in that game. It, I'll even admit that it was almost an unreasonable ask back then. It really was. Like, you you had to be ridiculously quick. 16, I felt, kind of hit the sweet spot just right. Oh, yeah. It's always good for baseball if the Yankees and Red Sox are in, like, a heated battle, you know. So, yeah, okay. Four-seam slider. Oh, my. I just, like, hit off his foot. That was weird. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Oh, nice. Nice. Yeah, Ethan, honestly, I think they screwed it up so bad that, that it really is just going to take, like, a year of, of rehauling everything. I think they kind of know that they got their work cut out for them. And, uh, I, or at least I hope they do. I don't know. I've seen some messages that indicate that they don't think anything's wrong at all. They think the game is playing perfectly. And that's, that is kind of scary. So, I don't know very possible that after red dead comes out like i just you know say peace out for the year to mlb the show but i doubt it I, i'm still gonna play a good bit i think i'm just gonna do uh, a lot of red dead redemption and i'm really excited about it too because i've been looking forward to that game for what like god almost 10 years now like eight years or something like that and uh and I'm really excited to be able to play it with you guys, you know. Hey, what's up, Slim? I did, I, have you, how long have you been in here? I don't remember seeing you in here. 16 with a smaller PCI would be perfect. I didn't really think there was a problem with the PCI size in 16. Maybe I'm misremembering. Like... I, I, cause I, cause I think at the at the higher levels right now, maybe it's the fact that the that the per nines are so high. Maybe that's it. But I actually think that the PCIs right now in, in, in certain spots are too small, like way too small. Um, but uh, but they're also too sensitive. Maybe if they toned down the sensitivity, I could live with the size of the PCI. So I don't know. Maybe you're right.
Oh, you lost your internet. Gotcha. Gotcha. All right, we'll get one out of this, not two. Yeah, Slim, I'm definitely not looking forward to the Babe Ruth grind at all. I'll let you have. I'll let you have second. We got the six-run lead here. No reason to. No reason to do anything crazy. Got him. Steer right three. Ball game. Nice. Does this get us into the the championship series division of champions? Or the or the division series division of champions? Okay, got us into the division series division of champions. Dude, Luis Gonzalez bobblehead. Just because it's a diamond. Nope. Uh, who do I want? Dude, Kevin Gosman. Give me Kevin Gosman. Just for the memes. Not even for the memes. Cervelli. Ugh. That's a stupid reward. But all right, guys. That's going to do it. I, I need to go to bed. It's uh it's 10 o'clock. I'm going to take care of some stuff and go to bed. I love you guys. Thank you so much for coming out tonight. Thank you for the donations. Gus, Adam. Who's the other guy that did? Uh, freaking uh, Sparky. Thank you, dude. Thank you so much. I don't need to check. I remember it was you, Sparky. Um, thank you, guys. I love y'all. I'm glad to be back. Uh, you guys kind of made my night. I, it was a happy night. So, uh, see so, ya. Yeah, I'll see you guys later. Peace.